it's neither here or there let me just get off that what i'm saying so what was i even talking about i was talking about uh, me getting my teeth done
then the doctor came and then she told me it's like oh it's it doesn't concern you it's about people who does it who just want to take it off just to take it off um just to take it off before their their teeth is where it's supposed to be so i'm like i'm, I'm happy with my teeth the way my teeth used to be the way my teeth used to be i showed you guys you already said i'm putting it up here again for you guys to see it was not cute i say it got to an extent where i'm brushing my teeth okay oh, oh why people be driving like they have no sense i don't get it so it got to a point where i'm brushing my teeth 41 c i'm brushing my teeth and brush my toothbrush is getting stuck in between my open teeth or i'm eating and my toothbrush my um, the spoon is getting stuck in my teeth so it's like uh, no, I, I don't mind how much this is. I'm gonna go do it. I'm gonna go do it. But they told me when I, this, they advised me on um, getting the uh, the Invisalign. <clears throat> she advised me for getting Invisalign that it's not going to be, it's not gonna be as effective. Uh, that I, oh my God, the amount of homelessness in this country. The amount of homelessness in this country baffles the shit out of me. Ish, ish. There's no dirty road. Honestly, when I've, I know I lost my train of thoughts real quick. When I first, before I came to this country when I was younger, the way they be telling us stories about America, it's like, wow, it's everything and some. Like you just go to the street, you're walking on the street, and the street is all gold, all nice things on the street. Like that was the mentality that we had when we were younger. But then when you when we came here, we realized that all the stories that they've been telling us is bullshit. It's a bullshit. Your day makes no freaking sense. But it's neither here or there. Let me just get off that what I'm saying. So what was I even talking about? I was talking about uh, me getting my teeth done. So I got it done. I'm like, ah, I'm gonna forget it. I'm getting this teeth done. No matter how much it's gonna cost me, it's gonna cost me. I just finished paying for it because I didn't want to finish paying for it. If I finish paying for it, it won't ginger me enough to say, let me go take it on. I'll just keep putting it on. So I paid. I paid. It was. It cost me three thousand five hundred dollars to get this thing. So literally a thousand dollars a year for the whole years so I've had this teeth on my mouth. This thing in my mouth. So it cost me about three thousand, three thousand five hundred to do it. I paid three thousand. My last balance was paid today, and I took it out. But babe, is somebody honking at me? For what? Why are you honking at me? But yeah, I really want to travel by myself this year for my birthday. Just you know, reminisce on where I've been, what I've done, what I still want to do. I want things to go you know this is my early 40s I just want to do things differently there was a lady that popped up on my TikTok the other day was it even TikTok or YouTube either one of them things shot. she popped up she's talking about parents and a mother not even just parents she's talking about mothers like you need to be good for yourself for you other people to benefit for you to be good for other people especially your kids your husband your boyfriend whatever it is that you have to be okay on your own part at first when she was talking i kind of be like what's she talking about like oh you gotta put yourself first before you put other person after you or whatever then i thought about it i was like oh my god she is saying the truth because if not if i'm not okay with myself how can i be okay for my kids if my mental mental state is not where it's supposed to be or i'm not i'm not i'm not okay on my own how am i supposed to be okay for my kids how am i supposed to let my kids in and make them feel welcome that i don't take the anger out on them so i understand what she's saying i really really do uh from her i thought about it i was like i, I need to get my mental state right 
like sometimes I'm 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 a I'm a kind of person that keeps to myself a lot. Even if you piss me off, sometimes I'm just gonna be you just need quiet. I'm not gonna talk, but then you're gonna not later on you're gonna be like, what's wrong today? And I'm gonna bust out on your behind. So it's just better for me to just you know by myself, no kids, no husband, no family member, no friends, nothing. I just wanna go away. I mean, it doesn't mean that I hate my kids or I don't want to spend time with my kids. Even me talking about it right now, I am a little bit emotional about it. But that's what I want to do. So, and my birthday is literally in three months. So, whatever it is, yeah, this is February, March, April, May. Yep, in three months. Um, I exactly three months. Oh, yesterday's the eighth, right? <clears throat> that's exactly three. <clears throat> exactly three, about like exactly three months from now, so... <clears throat> yeah, I think that's what I want to do. Okay, what's in there? All right, I'm back in the car. I've been home. Just dropped the kids home. So I decided to just do my Costco run. And my other run today because I'm not gonna have time tomorrow. I got work and I have my boss just called me. I have a big meeting tomorrow, so I'm not gonna have any time tomorrow. So on Saturday, I might be going out with my friend. I need to call her and confirm if we're going out. Um, yeah. So that is the deal right now. Um, I'm going to Costco. I'm going to Walmart. I'm going to uh, this lighting. Eh? It's annoying me. The way the light is not like me. Um, but yeah, those are the two places that I'm actually going. I have to buy gas in my car too. Okay, better lighting. I need to buy gas, so I'm buy gas at Costco. And when I'm coming back is when I'll go to Walmart because Walmart is not far from my house. And there's this new HEB that just opened up close to my house. I haven't gotten the opportunity to go there. They opened it two weeks ago. I haven't gotten the opportunity to go in there. So hopefully the lines um the line will be shorter now. Cause you know when they first open somewhere everybody and their mama wants to be in there so yeah Every day is easy, but I'ma keep it brief. 
Okay, yo, I'm done at Costco the shopping. Now I'm at Costco the gas station. <laughs> I need to buy gas in my car. I only have like 49 miles to go on my car. And that's probably just going to take me home and take me to work tomorrow morning. But I don't want to risk it. So, yeah. That's what we're doing right now. And I hope people hurry up because I want to go home. It's almost 7 and I'm still going to Walmart. Hey, yo, I'm tired. I'm hungry. I'm tired. So, I'm going to quickly do this um, haul for you guys real quick. And I'm going to bounce. So, the first thing I got is this ice cream. Popsicle is called Good Pop for the kids. Put it there. I got it. You waited to do it. I got two thingies of eggs because egg is a commodity right now. If you have eggs in your house, you are rich. Okay? So I bought those two. Eating a lot of dry fruits lately, so I bought this apple. Okay, this pink apple, pink lady apple, and I bought this uh, nature, nature's intent dry pineapple, organic dry pineapple, and I bought this Cockland organic dry mango. And then you have already seen this. This is a staple in my household. Yeah, and then I bought paper towel. That's basically all I got from Walmart. I mean, from Costco. And in Walmart, I got the soap thingy that I told you guys I was going to buy. The CeraVe cleansing thingy. I asked the dermatologist, and she said it's okay that I can use it. And then I bought my, my, my hair dye. And I also buy this cleansing, the foaming cleansing thingy. Is it even showing? Yeah, let me closer. The foaming cleanse, acne, foaming cleanse, and thingy. So that's basically all that I got. Nothing more, nothing else. The kids already bump into the ice cream. So, all right, guys, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go find me something to eat, and I'm gonna talk to you guys tomorrow. If I don't have anything much going on tomorrow, I'll talk Hello. to you guys on Saturday. And no. Isn't in my birthday yet, cause I gotta say You're looking like a gift for me Wrapped up nice and neat, baby Get in my way now, don't be shy We'll be here dancing day and night Get in my groove now, don't be shy Cause I got this list of my favorite things You could be the part where it all begins You could be the first and the second and the third And the rest of it Baby, I will show you how you can catch my vibe And right away I so much time Looping in the blurry lights
Thousand years later.
Cheetos. Freaking delicious. It smells really, really good. And then I went to Georgia Money and I bought this my way. Is it showing? Yeah, my way. It was buy one, get one. So, where's the other one that I got? I need. Oh, shit. Hold on, let me go get it. Okay, so I bought this one my way, and then I got the Judge the Terra Dijia, whatever Dijia, whatever it's called. This one right here, and the boat smell heavenly. They smell so freaking good. This one when you spray, you don't really, I don't really like it. But then the dry down of this one, the dry down of this lasts forever, like it lasts. Well, and this one too smells so freaking good. With the Georgia, um, uh, with the Valentino, I also got these two. Um, what do you call it? Sample, I'm gonna call it. So I got these two sample. I got. I don't remember what the name is. This one, and then I got this one. Two together was $35. Smells amazing. I just wanted to test it to see what it smells like before I go ahead and order another one. So I'm loving it. I'm going to go ahead and order this too. But the funny part, this doesn't have the spray. I don't know why they won't put the spray. So you have to like do that and that, that. Amazon, I bought me a couple of stuff. I bought these lashes. I feel like it's gonna be too long. It's okay, it ain't bad. So I bought these lashes, these lashes, and then I bought me this nail. This is so freaking cute. Like, you can't tell me anything. This green one is so freaking good. Look at it. Look at that nail. Oh my gosh, that is gorgeous. But if I that is so long, <laughs> I'm gonna have a problem. I got some good perfume. So I heard about this perfume from Good Perfume People on TikTok and stuff. It's called Casablanca. This show right here, no lie, no cap. Smells amazing. It's a Swiss Arabian um, perfume, and it smells like candy. Like if your man see you in this, he's gonna eat you. Up. I'm just letting you know. Like he ain't even gonna ask any questions. He's just gonna be on my phone right now. But it cost me about maybe thirty dollars. So this, and I know I'm going to love, love me. And then I went to Sheertex. If you guys have, don't know about Sheertex, Sheertex is a tight. They sell like tight, like um, stockings. But their stockings do not rip like regular traditional stockings, guys. I've had them for a while. I, the first one I bought from them, it's been almost three years now, and I just got rid of it late last year. Because you get, your girl gained a little bit of weight, so I couldn't into it the way I would like to get into it. They are good, 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 good stretch. They don't tear, they don't rip, nothing. So if you are into stockings, go ahead, I'll click everything that I have here, I'll definitely get into the box. So go ahead and check, check them out. And yeah, I went ahead, I already have two new ones that I bought, like in January. So this February, they were doing 50% off, I think. So I went ahead and I buy me two more of their stockings because I love stockings. The design and texture on this one is really, really good. This is the one I used to have. But, ooh, look, look how stretchy. This is a medium. Look how stretchy. Look how, if it's a regular traditional one, it would have been ripped. You can pull, you can do anything. You guys see the back here on this one put scissors in it and it doesn't rip I don't know if I put scissors in it I don't know if scissors in mine but that's what it is so 
So see, I got this in a medium. I love this texture. And the second one I got is... The other one is like a polka dot. I don't know if y'all could see in the screen. It's like it has like textured polka dot thingy. Or if I'm talking weird, because I have my retainer on. I went to go pick up my retainer two days after you guys see me go pick up, take my braces off. I picked up my retainer and look at this. Yeah, I can't wait to wear this. Oh my god, y'all see? Yes, girl. I also got this one in a medium. I love stockings. You can wear it on a short dress, you can wear it on the under a skirt and stuff like that. And you see how stretchy this joint is? Really, really good. If you are into stockings and stuff, check them out for your stuff. You would not regret it. jacket okay this is just a simple jacket a crop 
Oh, it was cut? I didn't even notice that it was cut like that. Okay. But this is what this one looks like. Really nice, cute jeans. I can wear it on top of one of those. Uh, maybe. So, y'all, yeah, this is what this gray one is looking like. I kind of like it. Y'all see how yeah, where the length is on me, right at my ankle. I wish it was a little bit tighter right there, but it's all good. It's all nice. This happy right here, I'm probably just going to wear it to the end. Yeah, this is probably kind of an airport outfit with that jean jacket. Let me pop the jean jacket on real quick and let's see what it looks like. This is what it's looking like. I'm not mad at it. I wish this was a little bigger though. This jean jacket, what's it did I get? Maybe. That guy is large. But this is what the jean jacket on it is looking like. I ain't mad at it, but I don't know about the shirt the outfit yet. I might be returning it, but the jean jacket is not bad. That's what the back is looking like. Looking like. It's different. That's what the back is looking like. It's not bad. But I just don't like the way it's so snug on my body. And look at this. This is where the crush is. This is where my crush is. So it's like no stretch. Lightly. Anyway, y'all not going to put stretch on something. But Okay, y'all. This is the next one. This is the other gray one. Wow. This is like night and day for the other one that y'all just saw me in. This is night and day, baby. This has a lot of stretch. And you guys can see it has a red material going on on it. And it has all this is what the back is looking like. I love it. Frame. This is the back. Really cute. And the length. Okay, uh, this is trash. Okay, I, this y'all see, I, this is how far I can move my hands. Like this is trash. Okay, it doesn't fit. Let me see if I can show you guys the back. What is this, Fashion Nova? This ain't it. I'm just letting y'all know. This ain't it. It doesn't fit. Okay, we really like this man. This leather one right here with this top. This top is more of a sweater, but the only thing about this is y'all see how short the arm is? Y'all see how short the arm is? But other than that, this is giving me life, honey. Let's check the back. Oh man, it is so nice. And it's also crop. It's also cropped and I love the way it is. We love this. We love this. So two things out of one four. I love this. Look at the way he just snatched my waist. Girl. Oh my suki suki now. You guys see this corset? Oh man, with this pants. Why do I love this pants more than I love the top? Like, I'm only keeping this because of the pants. Let me just, let's just, let's just be real, okay? But baby, do y'all see this top? Oh, this might be the top I'm wearing to the concert. But I can't, I don't think I can manage to wear a legging um, leather pants. It's just gonna be hot in there. You know, we all gonna be dancing. I could just see it coming that my man, I'm just gonna be sweating. Okay, I'm gonna lose like 10 pounds. I'm already losing 20 pounds as I'm standing here because it joins like second skin to my body. Like you see all my lumps and dumps at the back if you look closely. Guys, man, but this outfit will hurt. This is the back of the corset. I love it. I really love it. The two we're gonna be returning is this. This one's right here. It's so annoying. I don't understand why. Why I bought them. But anywho, I'm going to get out of this, clean my room up, put the trash things, and I'm going to be filled up better. Hopefully, it's not on that two days, three days, or a week. I'm sweating. I got to 